I feel the theme of the Grammys this year is a little schizophrenic. The number one theme in music, and we saw it with Skrillex, a house DJ getting five nominations, was the marriage of electronic DJ culture and, and Top 40. And those songs were, were huge. On the other side, the story is Adele. Adele, a singer-songwriter, has got two records out, and, and just simple songs. It, it steals the hearts of Americans. It'll be interesting to watch those two stories unfold during the telecast. We could have had I have to say Adele is uh, the big pick this year. You know, it was really refreshing, I think, for a lot of people to see a young woman, a uh, really young woman, uh, stand up there, write a great record, perform a great record, and uh, have that voice and that class and that stage presence. I think she could really sweep the Grammys this year. Baby, you know, Katy Perry had a great year, by the way, arguably one of the best, because the record yielded five number one singles. She's the first female to ever do that. Personally, though, I, I love the Adele story. Uh, I think Katy will win in a couple categories over Adele, but uh, if, if Adele went five for six, I'd be thrilled with that. And I always find, yeah, I always find something wrong. Kanye did two incredible things this past year in music, both of which are being celebrated, hence why he has the most nominations of any artist. I mean, he put out this, this record with Jay-Z, two of the, the kings at the top of hip-hop, and yet it sounds different. And then Kanye puts out his own work uh, by himself that is incredible. This could go to Bruno Mars or Lady Gaga because there's not a lot of other categories where they could get any love at all. Adele's record is great, but there's only maybe three singles that are very, very, very popular. They've been very slow to roll stuff out because they haven't needed to. So yeah, I'm gonna say I'm gonna say Gaga really might might steal this one. Greatness is what we want to bring up. This should go, by all accounts, to Nicki Minaj, who is, who's been prolific uh, in the year putting out music, and, and she represents everything that's been great in new music. My pick for song of the year is definitely um, Rolling in the Deep. However, if there was a category where Katy Perry was gonna beat Adele, it could be in song of the year. Even brighter than the moon. 